Hello Rebel and welcome back to my life and welcome to the first Friday video of 2019. It's a new year, it's a new me. It's not a new me, it's, it's the same old me. But as we like to do on this channel, I want to take a look back and see what we did in 2018 and see what we plan to do in 2019. So there's a number of things I look at to determine how well I did in a given year and one of the most important is called hours in the chair. This is just straight up amount of hours I spent doing creative work. This doesn't include making YouTube videos or doing marketing or any business stuff, nothing like that. And here is a graph of 2018's hours. I spent 591 hours in the chair last year. So there's two ways to look at this graph. One is to say, wow, that's the highest number of hours ever. But the other is to say, yeah, but that's still less than two hours a day. And even factoring in things like weekdays versus weekends, yeah, I still feel like I could be doing more. So I want to set what I think is an achievable goal for 2019 and get that number up to 750. 750 hours in the chair just doing creative work. Next up is words written and 2018 was a pretty good year here. I wrote over 368,000 words, which is the highest number of words that I've written since I started tracking them. I do happen to know for a fact, however, that that is not the most number of words that I've ever written. I know that I wrote at least 450,000 words in 2013. I just, I just wasn't tracking them at the time. So my goal for 2019 is again, something that I think it is reasonable to expect myself to achieve. I want to write 500,000 words in 2019, which will then actually be my most words ever. Next up is books published, and we published three this year, as you can see. The first is the novel Bloodlust, the second is the novel Stoneheart, and the third is the short story collection, The Chronicles of Underrealm Collection 1. Not the most we've published, as you saw on that graph, and in 2019, I want to beat it. Well, I'm not going to get into financial numbers in this video. 2016 was our best year ever, and what a coincidence, it's also the year that we published the most new books. So the plans we've got so far, which are always subject to change, is to publish five new books this year. Three by me, two by someone else. We want to step that up and do seven this year, three by me and four by other people. But a lot of stuff has to happen for that. And again, I'm trying to set realistic goals that I think I can actually achieve this year. If we do seven or even more, great. Right now, we're gunning for five. Okay, the next graph requires a little explanation. I started tracking the books I read, and in 2018, I tracked six books read, which is way under 26 in 2017. Here's the thing, I haven't been the best about actually tracking the books as I read them, so I know that I read more than six this year, just can't remember. This is the, this is my best estimation based on what I did and like what I marked to done on Goodreads and everything like that. And I know that I can read way more books than six, or even 26. So my goal for 2019 is 50 books, all of them tracked on Goodreads, reads slightly less than one a week. That should be no sweat, honestly. Okay, next up we've got videos made. This one is up over last year, but it looks like it's down under previous years. That's not exactly representative because I used to record vlog and novel in one hour chunks rather than one long multi-hour stream. So it made it look like there were a lot more videos when really it was around the same amount of content, but whatever. We want to set a goal in 2019 of 450 videos with which a daily stream and three videos coming out per week, plus my gaming videos. That should be very, very attractive. Achievable. By the way, this is a good time to plug my gaming channel. I like to play video games. You might too. And if you ever want to come hang out with me and watch me play video games, I have a link to Gareth's Games, now renamed Fortinbuff, in the description. Fortinbuff is my gamer name. It's just... It it is what it is. Just roll with it. I plan on doing game streams every Monday through Thursday throughout 2019, except when I'm at like a conference or something like that. So come on by. It would be great to see you on the channel sometime. Speaking of time... Eh? Yeah. Here's my YouTube watch time. It's over 470,000 minutes or 7,800 hours of you watching me on YouTube. Which, is just, that's a lot. Holy cow. But as before, it's not my highest ever and I would like to shoot for highest ever this year. I'm going for 600,000 minutes, which would be, it would be good. Be a nice bump. Be good to spend 100,000 hours with you. Actual views are down, which is weird and I don't really understand it, but whatever. We're shooting for 200,000 views in 2019. It's a nice round number. Even it would be nice. Finally, we've got subscribers, which, yeah, that's a nice graph. That's a good graph. That makes me happy. And in accordance with the promise that I made you on this very channel early in 2018, I want to see 5,000 subscribers in 2019. That would put me at 10K, and I, I feel like this is the year. I feel like this is the year we get to 10K subscribers. Here we go. Rebel, these year-end summary videos are always a lot of fun, but I think they're actually good for me in a certain sense. I try to always keep up a good face here on the channel, but on, on a day-to-day -day basis, I, I can get discouraged. I can get discouraged pretty easily, and I can get pretty discouraged. But when I sit down 
down and look at how much I accomplished over the course of an entire year, well, that's pretty great. I think we're always doing more than we think we are. And when we set back and look at the whole of it rather than one bad day or even a whole bad month, I feel like it's a lot easier to be a lot more hopeful. That's all I've got for you today, Rebel. Hey, now's also a good time to let you know that I have a Patreon. You've probably heard about the Patreon before, but now would be a pretty good time to be a patron. There's something coming. Something soon. <laughs> Thank you for a wonderful 2018, Rebel. I hope that your 2019 is as awesome as I am planning mine to be, and I will see you next Friday. Bye!